I was on vacation walking on the beach through some thick sand and did not feel I'd done anything, but my knee started swelling and hurting and I knew something was wrong. So that's when I came home and went to the doctor and they said, you tore meniscus. Things just snowballed from there. I tolerated the bad knee for three years till it was unbearable. Finally went to the doctor and he said, we've got to do knee replacement. And with that, I asked him if I could get physical therapy because I wanted to be sure that my leg was strong before I had the surgery because I knew that would be really important for me. I walked into ATI and they immediately were just the friendliest bunch. They just welcome you like they've known you for years. Prior to surgery, Vicki and I were able to improve her knee motion, and really we got her quad uh, significantly stronger, so that way, post-operatively, she was just ready to undergo the rehab process. It was tremendous therapy. She was so good. Things went way beyond what I expected. I was so prepared for the surgery. My leg was so much stronger. Post-surgically, I became Vicki's primary therapist. She makes being a physical therapist enjoyable. You can challenge her, and she tackles those challenges with her best effort. She's just an enjoyable person to be around, let alone a motivated person that's willing to get better. He's the most upbeat, encouraging person. He pushes you, but he knows when to stop pushing and just be your friend and help you with your issue. Probably one of the most memorable moments was being able to design a rehab program for her as a team and have a smooth transition pre and post-op. I think my pre-surgery physical therapy was very crucial in the recovery that I had, making it so much easier after the surgery. And I would debate anybody that questioned that. I dread the day I graduate. I will probably cry. Would never go anywhere else. I mean, I'm an ATI diehard.